Hi, I'm Charlie Kasov. I'm a math teacher, and today we're going to learn how to add fractions with variables and whole numbers. So first, let's come up with an equation. 5x, 5 over x, plus x over 3. Now, one mistake that a lot of people make is they see the plus, and they think that they can cross multiply 5 times 3. You can only do that when it's an equals. So instead, what we have to do is find the lowest common denominator. The way we do that is well, we want there to be a 3 over here, and we want there to be an x over here, so we multiply by the reciprocal. So here, we're going to multiply by 3 over 3, because 3 over 3 is just 1. It's not going to change the value. It's only going to change how it looks. So we end up with 15 over 3x plus over here, we're going to multiply by x over x, which gives us x squared over 3x. So now that our denominators are the same, we can add our numerators. So 15 plus x squared over 3x. Now, because there's an addition up here and there's no addition down here, we cannot simplify this any further. OK, what if we have different variables? So 5 over x plus 5 over y. Well, the same rules hold true. We have to multiply by reciprocal on each side to get the lowest common denominator. So over here, we're going to say 5 over x times y over y plus over here, 5 over y times x over x. So we get 5y over xy plus 5x over xy. So again, now that the denominators are the same, we can add the numerators. So our final answer is 5y plus 5x over xy. So I'm Charlie Kasov, and you just learned how to add fractions with a variable and a whole number. Bye-bye.